G'day and welcome to this week's video. Going to go a bit of a, a short overview of what we've seen with the markets over the last couple of weeks. Um, we've seen the uh, the Brexit issue uh, in the UK where they've uh, voted to leave the uh, the uh, European Union. Um, so that's had significant ramifications over there and uh, um, obviously we're about to see a, a new Prime Minister and a uh, female's about to take over this uh, coming week. So uh, yeah, as, as we see with uh, with markets and, and politics that um, things do move on and while it's a lot of short-term noise um, what I'm saying to clients is that um, businesses will still trade they'll produce services and they'll produce products that uh, end consumers can utilize um, and this will continue to happen and uh, while they may leave the EU and obviously these things aren't a done deal yet um, there will be new trade agreements uh, set up. So the thing I wanted to focus on today was um, the level of short-term noise and it, while it's, it's upsetting and makes investors nervous it has no real impact on the um, you know, the long-term prospects for high quality businesses. Um, I've got some really random numbers up here and what they are is the closing prices of uh, the All Lords from uh, the 16th to the 6th um, and right through to, to last night's close on the 11th of, the, uh, of July. And uh, in themselves they're just a, a random bunch of numbers. Obviously what uh, um, we can do, if my pen works slightly better, but I can uh, you can imagine there's a nice graph running through there and obviously that is the Friday the, the 27th of June and that's where we could see that there was going to be a, a lead vote come through. Um, and since then um, obviously we've had a few ups and downs but obviously we had a huge up day yesterday. So I'm not here to say that you know what happened overseas means nothing, I'm here to say that um, it is all short-term noise and we shouldn't really be focusing on the on such a short time frame. We're focused on buying quality businesses that have got great fundamentals and holding them for you know, five, ten or years or even for the rest of your life as long as the fundamentals of the business remain sound and they still retain a competitive advantage and have products that uh, consumers want. So obviously, yeah, interesting little graph. It's only a couple of weeks. Um, and I'm talking, you know, many years and decades of, of investing in businesses. So that's what I want um, my clients to focus on is the long term game. And all this is just noise in the short term and uh, shouldn't really worry you. Give us a thumbs up if you liked the video and please subscribe uh, down below and uh, we'll see you uh, next week. Thanks for listening.